Ooh, as you can see, I've got two boxes today. Um, looking at uh, one from Alicia, so I know this is going to be my Cavallo, or my Cav Cavallo, and the other one is from uh, from a member, and I won't uh, zap over there too much in case he has an address that he doesn't want anyone to see. That should be my Cody. So I think uh, without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and and tear into the Cavallo, and and uh, we'll go from there. Uh, I've got a little tripod today, so I'm going to set this off, and uh, hopefully I'll get everything in the frame. So here we go. See how that's going to work. like I got yesterday when I received my pack horse. This, who needs that? Don't need that anymore. You guys are getting this. Let me turn this down just a little bit. I may add a frame, but I'm not the important part of this video. It's, it's what's in here that's important. And again. Nice little sheath. I went for the, the belt loop attachment this time. Again with fire steel. This one is punched, um, just says number eight, whatever that means. So, stop that. I'm actually very uh, anxious to see what this knife looks like. Let me get this out of here too. Don't need that either. This is going to be my first and only uh, non-LE purchase, so this is one I, I can use and not feel bad about. Wow, it's actually it's a little bigger, a little beefier than what I expected. See that, all right? Got the large lanyard, three fisheye uh, pins. It's a little, a little dusty. Let's see here. Oh yeah. Takes it right off. See that? These knives are amazingly sharp. Set that aside. Get that out of the frame. Again, this is the Cavallo, or I believe it's actually pronounced, uh, if you're in Italy, the Cavallo. Cavallo is Italian for horse. I may have to take this and uh, if if carrying a fixed blade knife in California weren't illegal, you know, I would use this as my EDC. Actually, technically it's not illegal, but it's got to be uh, very well displayed and I'm not always sure I want it to be very well displayed. So anyway, I will, uh, I'll give this thing some use. I'll, I'll actually use this one for sure. I'm still debating on whether or not I'm going to use the pack horse in the field and um, here again, let's take a good look at the blade. Handle. And it's got the, uh, the nice blind horse logo. Points nice and sharp. So I'm, I'm very happy with this knife. It feels good in the hand. It is a little small, I will say that. Um, but all in all, it, it feels okay. I've got fairly large hands, so it does feel a little bit small in my hand. 
That being said too, though, it feels like it's got a lot of control, especially if I'm up you know, a little bit of uh, jimping wouldn't have been bad up here. Uh, it's got a nice sharpened uh, side, so it'll throw lots of great sparks. Very good. Can't wait to use it. Thanks, guys.